In V-Ray 3.0, the V-Ray frame buffers received a number of new features and updates. First, you'll probably notice the look of the interface has been refined, making the controls easier and clearer to identify. If we look at our render history, we've now added shortcuts to cycle through the images. In this case, I can hit 1, 2, and 3 to cycle through them. In our Color Corrections tab, we've added new controls for contrast, controls for hue and saturation, and color balance as well. If you select from the menu, you can choose to reset, save, or load any preset. Color management files for Open Color I.O., ICC profiles, and lookup tables can be loaded as well. If we load a cube file, and turn that on, we can now see an accurate look for the final image directly in the VFB. The new frame buffer gives artists more control to fine tune the look of their rendered image without switching applications. It also gives users the ability to view their images with correct color management applied. Thanks for watching and be sure to check out our other videos on V-Ray 3.0.